now a bit of, bit of a breeze. The sun is out. It's about an hour later. Different phone. And that's with no no jib up, that's just the main off a mirror dinghy. There's one of the islands and another over there. And there's a string of them along here. About um <clears throat> it's about two hours to low water. A beautiful day so far. Kind of surprised actually. See some sheep on the island. And Co-Patrick or the Reek, as they call it here, covered in clouds. It sticks to it like a magnet. All there seems to be clouds around that mountain. And you can just about see Clare Island again. This is two days after the last time I was out. Yeah, the day before yesterday. This is Monday, Saturday I was out. I'm only getting familiar really with the inner bay here. I'm more used to being out further in a larger boat. So the dinghy is new to me in, in, in that respect. I'm not used to sailing so close in shore. So it's kind of nice not to have a keel to worry about. No keel on these Drascom scaffies. There's two what they call bilge keels, but that's, uh, in my opinion, stretching it. They're more like two large bumps on the bottom. But they seem to actually do the job. Now, it's a light boat, otherwise that small sail wouldn't be driving me along. Now, I was sailing against the tide earlier, and I wasn't making a whole lot of headway, to be honest. <clears throat> I must see, look at the chart and see what those islands are called. If I can, actually I better pay attention here, I'm in a bit of a bit of an eddy current. My engine isn't functioning properly, so I need to rely on the sails and the oars, of course. But it's, it's kind of, the oars are, I feel, they're a little bit short for this boat and their positions aren't great. <clears throat> positions of the oar locks. But I think for two people it would be ideal, four oars. Now we're passing one of the the boys here, green, green to starboard on the way out, and red, no, green to port on the way out, and red to starboard, and there's the lighthouse looking over towards Mulrani. Uh, this bay is a, looks very small on the map. <laughs> but it's actually quite big when you're in a little dinghy just toddling along at maybe two knots. Anyway, if anything turns up, I'll be sure to inform you. Monday the 24th, Sailing Piglet. That's what this boat was called when I bought it, so no point in changing it. Piglet as in Winnie the Pooh, Piglet, just to see it up ahead there, amongst all the dunnage. Alright folks, nice to have you looking in on me, and um, take care of yourselves, 
and um, try to be good. God bless. Bye.